After a rash of shootings, religious groups organized a downtown, or rather a town hall meeting in Santa Monica this afternoon. They're calling on city leaders to create a plan to stop the violence. Suzanne Marquez is in Santa Monica tonight and has more for us. Suzanne. Jeff, several hundred people were at this meeting, including city leaders like the mayor of Santa Monica, council members, and the chief of police. But they weren't just here to talk about the problems. They also pledged to organize a plan. This afternoon, grieving families and concerned residents met at St. Anne Catholic Church in Santa Monica, calling for a response to youth violence. We've seen too many people um, die in the last 18 months of violence in the west side of Los Angeles. The church has recently lost six members in gang shootings. I lost my younger brother. He was 15 years old. He was in honors. He was playing football, baseball. L.A. Voice, an interfaith group, hosted the meeting. They're demanding concrete solutions. We are challenging the cities in the 90 days to come up with a plan of action to address this issue of violence. This challenge was presented to the mayor, council members, and the police chief of Santa Monica. The chief said youth at risk need alternatives to crime. That might mean working with L.A. County Probation Office to make sure that we have services that introduce our young men and women back into the community. They all agree it's important to work with surrounding cities. We know that these kids are traveling back and forth between different communities. And we have people that belong to a gang in Santa Monica, and they live in Culver City, live in Venice, live in Inglewood, and we have the same thing happening over there. We'll have Mayor Villaragosa at the table, and we'll have the county supervisors, because unless all of the 88 cities that are affected by gang violence are involved in saying no to it, we're really not going to make the kind of headway that we need to make. We're putting pressure on the city governments to take the leadership. It's easy to, to pass the buck, but we are saying to them that they need to take the lead. So these leaders agreed to create this plan, but they said that they'll need more than 90 days to do it. Either way, the group will be checking in in three months to see what the city has done. Reporting live in Santa Monica, Suzanne Marquez, Fox 11 News.